Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel, my name is Cordant and we will be continuing our playthrough of Baldur's Gate 2. So in the last episode we dealt with Axe Quest. This is an enhanced edition companion. It's one that I hate. <laughs> so I'm just gonna ditch her. The only reason why we did the quest was for her reward, Dragomir's Respite, which is a bag of holding, which is ex extremely useful to store all of our crap. <clears throat> so right now we are going to we are going to ditch her from our party <clears throat> and we're gonna pick up our actual sixth element. You would have me leave? I hate to see you leave, but I love to watch you go. Ah oh god, why did they put this cringy stuff in here? Yeah I think so. I suggest you I have many talents. That may be of interest to you. Yeah, a tempting quasi-offer, but my mind is made up. See you around, Exat. When you change your mind, and you will, you know where to find me. Actually, we don't, because she doesn't say. <coughs> but I do know that she will spawn... Well, not spawn. So she will be waiting at this spot where Clara, the, the girl she killed, was at the start. Okay. So, let's get this done. I am going to refresh my stone skins. Unless I already did it. Let me just check. Yeah, it's it's done already. Okay, so we can go. So this time we're gonna go into the sewers. Okay, so we need to go to the temple district. I think it's the only place you can enter the sewers, actually. Temple district. Enter Entrance to the sewers. And we will pick the last companion. We haven't even left Athkatla yet. We've only been searching the various districts and doing quests here and there. Okay. <clears throat> so the person we're looking for is actually around here, behind the hidden door, which Jan will be so kind as to discover for us. Not this one. This one is death. <laughs> but it's somewhere around here. Okay. So there will be some fights here and there. <clears throat> so we're gonna do some light pre-buffing here. I have a feeling that priest buffs are gonna be enough. Uh, so chaotic commands on myself. And remove fear. And sure, I guess one emotion. <laughs> this is gonna be enough. All right, let's go. Except Uncle Gerhard isn't passed out by the turnip still in the. We have a couple of methods. That's fine. Ow. Let's try and get rid of these. Yes, you burp. No, 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 no. Ow. Ow. Are you not attacking? Okay. It looked like Corgan wasn't attacking for a moment there. Okay. And we are going to meet a person that's over here. If I can bring my party this way. <laughs> Sometimes it's hard. Because 2.6 fixed pathfinding. Uh-huh. You sound like Golodon. Let's see, okay, there's a trap. Yes, yes. A standard tactic that. Okay, what do we have? A scroll, some money. Ooh. Okay, so you can carry some potions, I believe. You as well. 
You need to start carrying your weight, Edwin. It's treason, then. We still have proof that Mavar is trying to assassinate Renal. Something stranger. But we will deliver that as soon as we have our sixth. <clears throat> Here we find Mekrath. What is this? Intruders within Mekrath's domain? What brings you here, foolish man? Speak quickly, for I do not suffer errant fools gladly. Ha! Huh. I seek adventure, but if there is none to be had here, then you are of little use to me. Ha <laughs> ha! Spoken boldly, man! I may have a use for one such as you, if you truly seek adventure. Might you be interested in such an escapade? Hmm. Adventures comes with rewards. Name what you offer and I'll consider it. Well, aside from forgiving your intrusion into my presence, I am sure I can find something suitably rewarding for you, little man. Okay. Just what is this task, then, that you wish me to do? An annoying little imp shed its magical uh, collar a week or so ago, leaping about and causing much havoc. I attempted to capture him, but he was too quick. He escaped and took a rather important device I was experimenting on. A mirror. Unusable if you do not know the proper incantations. I would like it back. The imp has likely escaped the sewers, and your travel there would save me the time and aggravation of retrieving it. A word of caution. The imp may have picked up an incantation or two and may have used the mirror. One can only guess what it might have summoned up. Hmm, interesting. Uh, very well, I shall seek out this item and return. <clears throat> Run along then and return once you have the mirror. Okay, so let's let's first explore this area. Just to see what we can find. I could also murder that guy, obviously. But I think doing the quest is more fun. What? Oh, I can do that. Yawn. <clears throat> this looks very much like Durlag's Tower, so. Let's search for traps. Yo. One team mage, shield and spirit armor. Senor. Let's hope I don't get... No, 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 not you. I don't get jumped by invisible enemies. Okay, I'm definitely hitting one T. What is this? Hmm. Very interesting. <coughs> we shall discover it soon. Okay, so what the hell is hissing back here? Shall be done with skill and care, oh, if not brevity. I see. So you have a 1T mage, greater 1T, 1T and 1T. So the mage is the only one <coughs> actually capable of giving us some trouble. Can I get a chaos off before they actually start hitting me? Let's see. Oh my lord, wait a second. We have a bunch of 1T mages, not just one. So they have mirror images, they have shadow door. Are there two? Only two? It seems to only be two. <clears throat> okay, so they have minor globes, so they won't be protected against chaos. Minor spell deflection also doesn't do much. Stone skin, minor spell turning, shield, stone skin. Okay, we need to breach them. <clears throat> this looks like three mages, right? Protection, protection, protection. Okay, let me just check something here. Because I, I usually forget about this stuff. So, minor spell deflection. <clears throat> Who has it? God damn it. And minor spell... Okay, minor spell turning. This spell is similar. Okay, rebound. This affects a total of four spell levels, including spells cast from scrolls. But excludes the following. Area of effects. Ah, <clears throat> okay, so this spell will only affect up to fourth level spells, but as long as there are levels remaining, a spell will be reflected. Okay, cool. 
So it should not be... So a breach should be able to go through. Not so sure about minor spell... What's the name? Turning. Well, we shall find out. Chaos is going out. Move back. They are confused. <coughs> Let's improve haste on Corgan. You can't really do much. You can just shoot, I guess. You go over there. You stay over there. Yeah, just stay over here. Cast a bless. Be quick with it. And you can go murder. Dead. Okay, let's see who got confused and who didn't. Oh wait, you lost your stone skin. <coughs> That's not good. Woo! There's one right here. Mess him up, Corgan. Oh god. Okay, so he's immune because he has protection from magical weapons. Now the question here is, can I breach him? What? Is there a griffin about Let's find out. Have you nothing else to do but what do you have, me? Edwin? You can throw out the confusion, I think. Chaos, I mean. Okay, so breach is going out. It is as my concern. Breach hit. This one's done. Wonderful. Teleport 50 slashing damage. Ah, damn. Uh, Corgan, I want you to focus on the wizards if you can. This one is confused, this one is not. <coughs> Let's try and kill that one. You're losing your stone skins. <laughs> Man, berserking is so nice. Okay, so he is not immune. We are hitting and we are breaking his his mirror images. And he's gonna die. Well done, Corgan. So can always count on you. Stop being teleported. <laughs> Let's have Jan search for more traps. Okay, they only dropped long swords. Good. What else have we got? Yeah, this really does look like... Yeah, <laughs> like the Legs Tower. Huh. Cannot open this. Oh, but here we find someone. Someone by the name of Herdelis. I serve only Master Mekrath. Okay. <laughs> hmm. I'd say this man has been rendered magically mindless. A zombie servant. How useful. I can think of several others who could use similar treatment. <laughs> Thank you, Edwin. <coughs> okay, so yeah, we can do anything to him. Okay. So let's actually go down into the sewers and find what we need. And we'll... Oh, come on. And we'll be back over here very soon. Execute order 66. Good. And this time I need to go... Excuse me? Oh, you guys spawned. Okay. How lovely. Yeah. <laughs> Corgan's just gonna kill everyone. Give me your monies. Okay, we want to go over over here. Uh, 
Another green slime apparently spawned. There you go. So where is this imp? I think he's somewhere around here. Aha! Mirror is mine, Manling! Mine! <laughs> okay. Oh, he conjured up a lesser earth elemental. Okay, cool. Shouldn't be an issue. What are you casting, you bitch? Glitter dust. Well, he did blind Edwin. Do it. Ooh, cobalts. Let's just pick up the mirror. Mekat's mirror. An elegant golden framed mirror. This mirror, although broken, still exudes an aura of power. It is obviously the mirror that Mekrat has asked you to obtain. So it's broken. Hopefully it will be okay. <clears throat> Let's kill some kobolds. Oh, they have a shaman and a captain. What the hell? Yes. Are you still blind? You are. So just yes. stay over there. Yes, He actually cast hold person. It went through Viconius' magic resistance and through her, her save versus spell. I'm impressed. I must say I am impressed. It's treason. <laughs> so now I have a bit of time to drink some coffee because I need Vicony to get back. <clears throat> Come on, lady. You can do it. And this is why Animan would also be an interesting addition to the party <clears throat> instead of the person we're picking up. Because extra cleric spells are always useful. There we go. Okay. Now, I'm purposefully going the long way around because I don't want to go through the middle section just yet. Why are so many oozes coming over here? Palpatine dealt 14 damage. Still, Corgan deals 50, so <laughs> a bit of a difference. I need to find him a second axe because he's still using the long sword. It's not, it's not that bad, but it's not it's not ideal. Okay. Let us go back to Mekrath. Ah, I also need to explore this area. This might this may have some scrolls. Hello. You need something stranger. Well, what is it? You have the mirror, I assume. Yeah, I do. Here you go. Ah, this is the one. Tch. The moronic beast has cracked it. Tch. It shall take weeks to repair. I certainly hope you kill DM for his in for this indignity. But you must be rewarded as we agreed. There is a slave, a thief I caught recently, that should be more than adequate. <clears throat> sure, I'll take a slave. <laughs> I suppose that's what I have to do. Good. I believe I left him in the North storeroom, counting rice or some nonsense. <laughs> oh, poor guy. Go and claim him. He is yours. Do whatever you wish with him. I care not. I, for one, will need to gather some materials to fix this blasted mirror. I trust you will not be bothering me again. And poof, off he goes. Does he have anything of interest here? He does. Wait, he has a wand of cloud kill, that much I know. This I don't know what it is. Huh. 
<clears throat> I'll identify this stuff very soon. So be it. Hopefully without spending charges from the glasses. My... my head clears. Filled with stars and liquid fire. And I see before me the new holders of my shackles. Wizard has released me, I say, but only to pass my reins to another. So, I'm to be your prize, am I? A mockingbird to sing your petty praises? <laughs> my prize? I don't own anyone, I would rather you were my friend. Oh, a rose by any other name. My dear and rescuing raven, you don't even know me. What if I turned out to be quite unfriendly and not at all a nice person to be spending time with? <laughs> I like this option. Well, let's try and be friendly. Point taken. Tell me about yourself then. <clears throat> Beneath this petty poet's skin, I am a planeswalker and a doomguard, Burke. I am the best swordsman of the Prime Material, second only to Drizitim himself. Oh, I doubt it. In Sigil, one, only one can best me, and she is my half-sister. I have survived the Outer Plains and a year of service in the retinue of a Baylor. Above all, I am a Thiefling. I am a half-elf, and while my father was of the Fair Folk, my mother was no human. Will that be enough? I'm actually interested in this. The Doomguard, what's that? <clears throat> ah, you are not a denizen of the plains then, are you? We are the guardians of decay, the saboteurs of meaning, the agents of destiny. And that destiny is that all things falter. All things fail. The multiverse is a snake that has caught its tail in its mouth and begun to swallow. Now I like you, Burke, and I have extended my hand in friendship. Will you extend yours in turn? Very well, Herdelis. Friendship. Welcome aboard. Friendship then. You have freed me from one set of chains, but there is another task I must perform before that freedom is complete. I was to deliver an important gem to my mistress, Rayleigh's shy of the Seagull Theatre group, uh, troupe, but the late Makrat chose to relieve me of its possession. I believe the jewel lies within an altar here. If we can find the jewel in complete delivery, then I shall place myself at your every command. Okay. <clears throat> And we picked up Mr. Erdelis. Let's just suddenly swap some stuff around. And, and Erdelis is a blade. <clears throat> so a blade is a bard subkit. He is a tiefling blade, chaotic neutral. And his ability scores are not that bad, but not that great either. 17 strength, 17 dexterity. <laughs> Kinda decent. Constitution is horrible, and the rest doesn't really matter. <clears throat> so, let's level them up. Our friend here has two points in short sword. Actually, let me just read this again. So, one, one weapon proficiency, saving throws reduced, as always, tackle reduced. He has the ability to cast mage spells, as any bard can. <clears throat> and he can now cast level 5 spells. He also has a bunch of lore. What else does he have? <clears throat> so, two points in short sword. Cannot put any more. One point in dagger. One point in dart. And two points in two weapon style. Okay, so... <clears throat> Mr. Erdelis here is probably gonna be the one... Wielding the flail of the ages. So, my friend here is gonna take one point in flail. And again, if I was not taking her lease, I would probably take Anaman. Also because I don't really play a lot with Anaman, and I was gonna try him out. <clears throat> but Erdelis also, I don't play with him that often. Okay, so one point into Flails. He already has two points in two weapon style, which is awesome for us. And let's see his spells. <clears throat> so not many. You can take one blindness and two magic missiles. Over here. I want mirror images. 
You can take a slow, I guess. Or, or not slow. Take a flame arrow. Mm hmm. He does not know any level 5 spell and onwards. Okay. <clears throat> so, something we're also going to have to do is actually teach some spells to both Edwin and Erdelis. And I do have the scrolls for it. And I'll probably do that in the next episode. What is this? Ooh, contingency. Nice. Spell turning? Spell deflection. Close. I was close. Nothing here. Okay. Now, let's see. Erdelis comes only with two short swords, I believe. So he has entropy plus two. Uh, hit target must save versus poison or suffer three points of poison damage. Other than that, just a, a plus two short sword. And he also has a chaos blade in which hit target loses two points of dexterity per hit for five rounds. It does not say it's non cumulative. Interesting. So I think I actually prefer this <coughs> on the main hand to drain dexterity. And we need to find him some armor. So first of all, I think I can give him this actually. Okay, much better. He needs a hat. Cannot use it. Let's check over here. What can I actually... Oh, I can give him the tangled strings. Uh, can you use this? No. That's pretty much it, actually. So take this. Take 15 of these. And his lore value is supposed to be quite high. So 73 compared to 46, 41, 27, 2 and 17. <clears throat> so he should be able to identify a lot of stuff. Yeah, so a wand of cloud kill. You can actually take that. Necklace of form stability. Save versus polymorph. Sure. Ooh, a rod of resurrection. It's actually wonderful. It can resurrect my party members. Special race target is fully healed. 10 charges. Awesome. <clears throat> and... I guess you can identify this. Let's bring it... Eh, you can take it. Okay. And start identifying stuff from the sack. Take this out, take this out, out, out. Okay. Best of plus one, speed plus one, cellular armor plus two. Yeah, so spell casting gets disabled, not ideal. Battle axe plus one. Here we have the Wyvern's Tail plus two. <clears throat> the hit target must save versus poison or take five hit points of poison damage. Okay. A quarter staff plus two. AC seven. This is the shaman item from the Dragon Spear. Dagger plus two. And these I can't identify. So I can give these to myself. We have a staff of curing. Ooh, this is nice. This is very nice. Ah, but it has charges. What? It doesn't have charges. What the hell? Okay, let's just give this to Ed. Ah, okay. So it's gotta be a druid or a cleric. Um, okay, so keep this with you. And this is a guess and bow shaft. <clears throat> so this is actually something that you need to combine 
with another item. So for now, we can just store this all in here. Some of this stuff to sell, other stuff just storage. And we are going to get his gem. Retrieve Herdalise's gem. And I believe it's in this halter he's talking about. There you go. The gem, we have it! Come, my birds, let us to the playhouse fly! <laughs> the inn is in the bridge district of this city, in the basement of the five flagons. Oh, give me a second, please. And I'm back, sorry about that. <clears throat> so, the gem, we have it! Come, my birds, let us to the playhouse fly! The inn is in the bridge district of this city, in the basement of the five flagon. Blech. Of the five flagons. Okay, so we did pick up the portal gem. A portal gem is used to open up portals between the planes. If you know how to use these gems, and they are said to occasionally have undesirable side effects. This particular gem was found on an altar in the house of Mekrath. <clears throat> we also found some nice money jewelry. And a harp of discord. Even the most talented bard cannot get this harp to play in tune. <laughs> Each stroke of the harp strings results in a harsh, off-key note. If the bard attempts to play a proper ballad upon the harp, its magical effects are released. All creatures, other than the bard and his or her party, must make a saving throw versus spell or be confused for 30 seconds. Wonderful. Confusion 3 times per day. <clears throat> Wonderful. So we have Dispel Confusion and we have Confusion. <laughs> Sweet. Okay. Do it. Okay, so have I checked out what's upstairs? Or is there not an upstairs? It appears as if construction for a second level starts with a fin Oh, okay, this is lazy. <laughs> but, okay. So, <clears throat> we picked up Mr. Erdelis, which is going to be our second frontliner. Patience, my friend. And we're going to take him back. Where? I can either go and do his quest now, which can be quite difficult. But he does need some gear, and he gets some decent gear from there. I'll have to think about it. Okay, so I think for now we're gonna take our time in the Copper Coronet. I'm gonna give some spells for Edwin and Erdelis to learn. And then maybe we will go and I do his quest. And I think that I may have been exceedingly harsh in my treatment of you once again. <laughs> Holy god! Don't worry about it, Viconia. Understand, Palpatine, I have not been on the surface for all that long. Sometimes I forget the things that are different from the world I once knew. I have toyed with your feelings unfairly, placing you down with the other males I have known, and you have not been like them. It was wrong of me. Mm. <laughs> I guess it's understandable. Don't worry about it. What? No hatred or righteous indignation. Such meekness is pathetic and weak, Palpatine. If you showed anger, I would expect such and accept it. This acceptance of yours is much more difficult to take. But I suppose I should be grateful for it. But before I retch out of pure disgust, <laughs> let us continue on our way. <coughs> okay, so I show her kindness and she does not like it. Okay. And I feel anxious with Erdalis just walking around butt naked. Oh well. It will have to do, I suppose. The slums. So be it. must 
And I think I can finish the episode uh, leveling, not leveling up, <laughs> giving them some spells. <clears throat> because they do need to learn. And I might as well do it now before we actually start um, Herdalis's quest. And even Edwin's quest. Because Edwin's quest also has a, a somewhat tough fight. So let's start off by learning stuff with Mr. Edwin here. I'm gonna drop all this on the ground. I hope I won't forget it like last time. Uh... Okay. <clears throat> so what we got? Chromatic Orb, Vocalize. Blur, Color Spell, Invisibility. Take it, take it. Very nice spell to have. Wonderful spell to have. Death Fog, Improved Haste. I should be able to learn this. Okay. I can. Wonderful. Now, he's gonna get the better spells. The more powerful spells, because he's a superior spellcaster. Uh, when compared to Yon. And hopefully I have a simple spell immunity. And I... I do. And I can give these maybe to Herdalese. Maybe to Jan. <clears throat> I'll have to consider it. Spider Spawn, Shadow Monsters, Minor Sequencer, Secret Word. Fire... No, this will go to Herdalese, actually. Enchanted Weapon, Holden Dead, Spell Trust, Feeble Mind. Divination. Melfs, wonderful. Old Monster. And we are full. So Edwin is pretty much the greatest spell the greatest spellcaster companion in the game because of his nice amulet. This is Edwin's birthright, inlaid with his family stone. What this does is allow Edwin to memorize two extra wizard spells of each level. <clears throat> it's it's quite the effect. It's a very, very powerful item. Only Edwin can use it, of course. And that pretty much makes him the best spellcaster companion. No doubt. Okay, can I learn this? I can. I can. Okay. Now, from here. Ice Storm, Chill Touch, Lightning Bolt. Special Magic Energy. Energy. Nice. This is level 6. Still. Oops. Did I mess something up here? I might have. Because I clicked too fast. Hmm. We'll see. Do I already have this? I do. No, this will actually go for Herdalese. So, wait. Big Beast Clenched Fist, Pierce Shield, Symbol Stun, Symbol Death, Sunfire, Enfeeblement, Glitter Dust, Low Resist, Normal Weapons, not so sure about Limited Wish, but we'll see. Okay. Wonderful. Okay, so what else we have here? Hope, Emotionless, <clears throat> I mean Hopelessness. Autolux Freezing Sphere, Stone to Flash, Spell Turning, Monster Summonings, Spell Shield, Wonderful. Okay. We're also gonna get a lot of experience from this. Not that I really need it, but still. Take this, this, this. 
Ruby Ray, wonderful. Spell Sequencer, obviously goes for him. Uh, no, I put this back, yeah, okay. Oops. This one is done. Skull trap, of course. So as you can see, we have a lot of spells to learn. And I'm probably only going to give <clears throat> some specific spells to Herdelis. Because if Edwin permanently dies, I would still want to have some more spells to give to another spellcaster that may come in his place. Another Phantom Blade here. So Jan will have it. Disintegrate. Mm-hmm. 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 Okay, so a bunch of experience, and now, let me check, I can pick this back up, or give these to Erdelis. Pick these back up. What is it now? Oh, come on. Uh, One day. One day. I can just drop this. Or mm -hmm. readier than a red cheeked maiden, mm. my friend. <laughs> this guy has some nutty voice lines. <clears throat> did I give this to Wait a second. Did you did you check this out? Okay, he did. So take it. I have two of each, so I can give some of them to him. I also want spirit armor. I could use this. Um. So learn all this stuff. Skull trap. I also want it on you. Lance of disruption. Is it per level? It is. Okay. So give one of these to Herdelis as well. One lightning bolt. That's fine. Dispel magic, I want it. Vocalize, I want it. Cat's grace. Actually, not cat's grace. Done. I can take this, of course. I can take this as well. Protection for magical weapons, I do want it. Minor Sequencer, Fire Shield, Enchanted Weapon. Okay, <clears throat> let's give him these. Magical Weapons. Or should I give this to Jan? I mean, Hercules is going to be more on the front line, so he can take it, I think. Can take one of these, one of these. Minor spell turning. I want spell shield on him. Shield. Uh, maybe a contingency as well. 
I'm not sure about this one though. Yeah, because Jan can also use it. Hmm. I can give you one of these just for experience purposes. This might not actually be too bad. Surrounds a custard with invisible barrier, it moves with him. This barrier makes the wizard immune to any magical attacks, but it prevents him from casting spells. <clears throat> so if there were someone to use this, I think it could be Herr de Lys. Eh. Ooh, remove magic is very important on a bard. Yes, it is. Stone skin. One of the most important spells for him. Uh, okay, so I have an extra contingency, so we're fine. Okay. Let's learn the con Do you have it? You do. Learn this, learn that, learn this, and this, and that. And I believe we are done with Herdelis. Okay. So I'm gonna give these back to Jan. And now, any cool stuff. I, I, I still need um, a spell immunity for her release. Okay, so this is the stuff that both Edwin and her release already know, right? I mean, this doesn't matter. This does not matter. Only Jan doesn't know it. This is a summon. Okay, that's it for this one. As for this one, I guess I can take Sunfire and the Contingency and Chain Lightning and... Oh, there's a lot of stuff I can take. <clears throat> Power Word Sleep. Okay, so this is irrelevant. Contingency only for myself. And I can take it. Chain Lightning, irrelevant. You should take this one. Okay, so that's that. No, I, need, I still have one more spell here, I think. Power Word Sleep. Take it. Black one. Power Word Silence. I guess I... Man. Should I give this to Erdelis or to myself? To myself, I mean Jan. I can give this one to Erdelis. No, no. Uh, na, 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 na. We'll see later. So learn this one. Red one. Does Herdelis have spirit? Okay, he does. And finally... Okay, so everything is done. Everything has been cleared. <clears throat> we gained a lot of experience with this. Due to this many spells being learned. But I will deal with that in the next episode. Because I'm going to lose a lot of time selecting which spells I want for Palpatine. So yeah. <clears throat> so next episode. We are going to set up the spells for each one of my casters. I'm also going to level, level them all up do spell selections, uh, especially for Palpatine, since he's a sorcerer, it's going to take uh, a bit of time, so I'll think about this before I start the video, to choose which spells I'm actually going to take, and, and yeah, and then we are going to... stuff we need to do quickly. I have Herdely's quest, I have Edwin's quest for the Nether Scroll, that one's actually quick to do, so I'm, I may start with that one. And I also have to complete the um, Renal Blood, Blood Scalp questline. So in the next episode I think I can maybe knock off two of those quests. Maybe start the third one. Because two of them are very quick. Herdelis is going to take some, some time. But yeah. So as always guys I want to thank everyone for being here in the channel watching some of my videos. I hope you guys are having fun. If you have any thoughts, any questions, you know what to do. Leave a comment. If you want to get notified about future videos being uploaded to the channel, feel free to subscribe. And I hope to see you all in the next episode. So until then, stay safe everyone.